This skill module discusses electrical submersible pumps at the core knowledge level. This section discusses why this topic is important. Almost every well, onshore and offshore, requires some sort of artificial lift during its life. Choosing the right artificial lift system is critical to maximizing production as well conditions change. This module will help you understand the electrical submersible pump ESP well conditions required to maximize production at the lowest cost. ESP artificial lift has a unique operating profile as very expensive and complex equipment is installed deep in the well. This makes repairs complicated and maximizing time between equipment failures is the key to success. Management of ESP systems requires design, troubleshooting, and optimization, all of which are covered here. ESP projects require a large investment in each motor and pump run down hole, which can easily be destroyed by poor design or mismanagement. Understanding how to design and operate these pumps is key for success. Choosing the right artificial lift system is critical to maximizing production as well conditions change. ESP systems allow you to produce from low-pressure, low-rate wells and high-pressure, high-rate wells depending on the field. Understanding which ESP system is required at each stage in the well life will ensure that you maximize both recovery and production. ESP systems require a complicated workover program to pull tubing and electrical cable and then run new pump, motor, and cable into the well. Workover BOPs need to be supplemented. Minimizing workovers by good design and operation is key to ensuring the ESPs are one of the safest artificial lift systems. This skill module discusses the topics shown here. You may also be interested in the skill modules shown here.